Six here coming to you from the Billboard Hot 100 Music Festival, and I'm joined by Maggie Lindemann. Hello again. Hello again. <laughs> We've been hanging out all day, yes, you know. We have. You were a fun person to hang out with, I have to say. Thank you. So are you. Um, and we're also, Spice Girls is playing right now, so it's kind of perfect for us. It is. Did you want to, like, dance? It does, actually. The I whole love time this. I've been sitting back here, hearing everyone perform. I'm I like, know. Can we dance I now? Know, just like, um, you're performing tomorrow here at the festival. Yes, I am. Uh, what does it mean to you to be performing at the Billboard Hot 100 Fest? I'm super excited. Um, this is my first festival in the States, so I'm beyond excited. It's just so amazing, and I literally just cannot wait. How do you prepare for a festival like this? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I've been rehearsing a lot. We've been in rehearsals every day for um, the past few weeks, and just like in my apartment like singing my set and um yeah just like i've been prepping my outfits and everything like shopping Perfect. that is the most important exactly. thing exactly i've been shopping every day like no that one's not right this one's not right so i've definitely been like perfecting yeah and you settled on barbie i like it today is barbie yes. barbie day yes um talk to me about the music i know you're working on an album right now what's inspiring you what, what do you want as a musician what are you putting out there what do you hope to put out there in the near future so i always want to put out you know music that I'm relating to at the moment and stuff I'm going through. I never want to put out something that that I don't personally feel. So for me, when I make music, it's about you know like what I'm going through, what's happening in my life at the moment, and just like sh not even just struggles, but good things in yeah. life too. What what are you going through? What can you kind of tell us? Let's dish, girl. <laughs> Let's get real. Life is really good right now. I really have no complaints. Like. Life has been amazing lately, so right now it's just all happy vibes, and um, I've definitely written some, uh, you know, some little shade songs, some little... <laughs> it happens. Here and there, but right now, yeah, I'm just like really happy in my life, and things are going really well, so I've been trying to stay super positive and keep the positivity. Good. Awesome. Well, we're going to play a game. It's called The Last Five Posts, and we're going to go through the last five posts that you posted on Instagram, okay? So let's see. Here <laughs> oh we go. God. What do we have here? You need to tell me all about them. All Why right. did you post it? What inspired you? Okay. This yes. is cool. Yes. I saw this actually. This is really amazing. But Thank you. Please tell us. Oh, yeah. So I was actually on the plane. Um, I was going to sleep on the plane last night, and um, I, I got a notification on Twitter, and I went to Twitter. I saw this. I, I, didn't, I didn't even know. Um, that it had hit platinum yet, so I saw it on Twitter, and I just got super excited. So I immediately like screenshot it and posted it, and was like, "Oh my god, so good!" So obviously, yeah. if you, did you tour in Australia? You said you've toured in other places. I not haven't. I've never been to Australia. I've always wanted to go to Australia. Literally yesterday, I was talking about how I've always wanted to go to Australia, and then I saw that, and I was like, "Okay, well now I have to go." That's so. It's so funny how certain songs hit in certain countries, and like, why? You know? Yeah. It's, 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 it's really crazy. cool. So congratulations on that. Thank you. All right, let's look at the next post. What do we have here? Okay, okay. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I was just <laughs> on the plane. Um, I just wanted to post something so people knew I was, like, on my way here. So that was kind of my post. Was this before or after you saw the that was certified before. platinum? <laughs> that was before. That was right when I got on the plane. If you were to post after, what would have been your reaction? Oh, my God. I would have been like... <laughs> hey, I probably would have posted a video or something like, oh my god, guys, thank you so much. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, okay, let's go to the next post. What are we at? Number three. Okay. Rehearsals. I was in rehearsals. I liked the whole yellow thing that was going on on my feed. So I was like, post. I love it. What do you do before you go on stage? What's kind of like your ritual? What do you, how do you get prepped? I like to keep really calm. I like to just kind of keep going about my day. Like, because I get really, really nervous um, going on stage. Mm -hmm. If I stress myself out or if I'm you like overthink it, yeah. If I overthink, so I try to like keep calm, like FaceTime my friends, do like normal kind of stuff like that, and then and then I'll like run through the songs in my head right as I'm walking on stage. Wow, I can't even imagine. I feel like it must be. I mean, are you nervous right now just thinking about your performance tomorrow? Or, or? I'm actually not nervous. I don't really get nervous until like right before. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's see the next post. What is Maggie posted? Okay. Again, rehearsals. <laughs> I've been in rehearsals for a while now, so my life's been like rehearsals, rehearsals, rehearsals. So, and what is the rehearsal for exactly? It was for this. Oh, it yeah. is for this. Okay, mm -hmm. I can't. Um, yeah. Very cool. Can you give us a little sneak peek for the, those that aren't going to be there tomorrow of something you're going to do during your show? 
Well, I added a cover onto my set list that I've never done before, so I'm super, super pumped about that. It's by one of my favorite artists. So, Can and you I, say what it is? It's by Rihanna. Okay. I'm not going to say what the song is, and I've never covered this song before, so I'm super pumped. Do you think it's one that you will put out after? Maybe do your own cover on it? Maybe. I've been thinking about so many covers to do, but... I just, I don't know why, I just haven't done them, but I love doing covers, so. Who, who is an artist that you look up to? I mean, obviously Rihanna must be one of them, but yeah. who else is someone that you sort of um, aspire to I be I love like? Lana Del Rey. Oh, yeah. She's her new like, album? Oh, my God. I saw her <laughs> actually at Amoeba um, in Hollywood, so, like, just very recently. And that was my first time ever seeing her live, and it was absolutely amazing. She's so, just so cute and, like, <laughs> I don't know. She wasn't all, like, Hollywood and stuff. She was very calm and laid back and... I really just look up to her. I think she's so cool. Did you go up and say anything to her? Like, would you go oh, up God, and say, no. no? No, I would never, I would, no, I would never. I'm too, like, I'm too shy. And also, I don't know, I would want to meet her in, like, a work scene, yeah. I feel like. And then I would express to her, like, oh, by the way, when I, I really love my career, you. Yeah. yeah. I really love you, by the way. Definitely. Yeah. What has been your most starstruck moment? I met Rihanna. That was and, how, and tell me how it went down, girl. Um, so it was at a milk makeup event, and it was for her launch of the new season of her line. Um, and they told us Rihanna was going to be there at this at a certain time, and the time passed, a few hours passed. So I was like, oh my god, she's not going to come. It's not going to happen. And soon enough, she walks through the doors. Everyone's freaking out. Um, and luckily, the way you got to meet her is if you had like if you had picked out an outfit or like shoes or whatever from her new line and like put it behind the register to, to buy later and you did of and course I had shoes waiting <laughs> so I was like oh my god like I have stuff and she called my name out and I was like me hi and I got to go up and she was like my checkout person and awesome, awesome. I love that I love hearing yeah. those stories um we have to do your last post your fifth post so let's see it What's this? Yeah, that's me and my friend Denzel, my best friend. Um, that was right before Teen Choice Awards. And, uh, yeah, basically it was just a Snapchat. He just said pose, so I posed. Awesome. Maggie, thank you so much for hanging out with yeah, us. Yeah, thank you for You're having the best. Good so luck fun. tomorrow. You're going to kill you. it. Thank you And so we much. can't wait to see what Rihanna cover you're going to do tomorrow. So <laughs> yes. we're looking out for that. Uh, and thank you guys so much for watching. We will see you soon.